And on today's episode of Words That Damien Doesn't Know How to Pronounce, we're going to be taking a look at my all-time favorite artist, Zion, which I have named my cat after, the one, the only, Ishan. Uh, apparently, uh, Ishan dropped a new video yesterday, and it just happened to come up on my homepage, and I thought, I really want to see this. But then I thought, no, you know what, uh, we're going to watch this together. I'm going to watch this with everyone who is kind enough to support me and watch my videos. So, uh, this is something we're going to do together. I'm going to share the love of my favorite artist with all of you. And we're going we're gonna to jump into this. Uh, the name of this song is Stridig? Stridig. 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 I S T R I D I G. I I don't know. I believe it's Norwegian. But so uh, yeah. Before we get started, so uh, Ishan announced that he's going to have instead of doing uh, a regular full-length album this year, he's going to release two EPs. Uh, I don't know if they're both going to be released in February, but. I, I know at least one is, possibly both, but one he said is going to be more of his typical uh, experimental kind of stuff that, you know, he's been doing with his solo albums for the past, like, you know, nine, ten years, whatever, and then the second one was going to be a more raw, like, uh, black metal kind of sound, and very, I think the whole EP, the, the black metal EP is going to be in Norwegian. So, uh, I'm excited for both of these releases. Uh, I, I hope they both come in February. That would be absolutely amazing. So, I don't know which which one this song is going to be off of. Either one, I'm here for it. Uh, speaking of Ishan, there's my cat. Um, yeah, let's, let's go ahead and do this. Alright, here we go. This is Ishan. angrily cutting down like all of the trees it's <laughs> just like I will leave no trees standing <laughs> I got jokes but yeah this is this is tremendous so far like there is a lot of, a lot of 
definite like signature Ishan elements in this which I love and I still like I have no idea which EP this is going to be off of because there's you know there's a lot of black metal elements to this but there's a lot of like I was saying Ishan's signature sound to this so it's it's really hard to know at this point you know just with all of his his facial expressions and his gestures and you know it it looks like it would be leaning more towards black metal but it sounds more like traditional Ishan we'll keep going So far, in a lot of ways, this song is very reminiscent of the first two solo albums that he did, uh, The Adversary and Angel. Uh, this is very, very reminiscent of both of those albums. And, uh, you know, that that sound, both of those are two of the most epic albums I've ever heard. And <laughs> I really can't wait for this EP. Oh, he just found a cool necklace. Or a coin. Wait, so who's this little, little boy? Is that baby Ishan? Oh, the coin magically turned him into a little boy. He just dropped the magic dragon coin into the fire. Now he's going to stay a little boy forever. Well, that was absolutely magnificent on every expected level from him. Um, it was so good. And I seriously, I know I've already said it like several times, but. I cannot wait for this EP to drop. And there's really, there's nothing more I can say about that song. The video was really 
it's kind of interesting not sure I followed the storyline exactly other than he uncovered some magical coin and then he was a little boy again in the exact same scenario I could be completely wrong I probably am completely wrong I'm usually wrong on these things and that's okay it's okay to be wrong all the time okay anyway uh, thank you for sticking around and watching this with me and I hope you enjoyed this song as much as I did and if you didn't I'm sorry but if you did uh, go ahead and let me know in the comments down below how much you love this song and this artist and until the next one good people of the interweb <laughs>